Welcome back, this is the Amajack. We got Mario 64 Remastered Suicidal Commando. I was planning on doing Gunslinger actually, but uh, so much for that. Guess we'll go for a Commando win, hopefully. As long as it's not the Matriarch. Really, I just I don't know how to fight the Matriarch as Commandos is the main problem. It's not good at it, you know? Anyway, some to talk about. Oh, that shot would have been glorious if it hit. Okay, none of these shots are very glorious. Some to talk about. Some to talk about. I don't know, man. There's these uh, these co there's a couple of girls going around in my cul-de-sac earlier. I don't know what they wanted, but uh, I've never seen them before. Might have been related to somebody around here, but they were going. It looked like they're going house to house. I wasn't paying much attention to them because honestly, when I see somebody out in my cul-de-sac, I don't really care. <laughs> so I wasn't paying much attention to them. They might have just been coming from a house and then left, but uh, it looked like they came from somebody else's house and then went to another person's house. So it uh, looked like they're going maybe uh, door to door for for something, but I didn't get them at my door. So maybe they hate me. Who knows? Anyway, we did not get enough money. Can we find, like, a gun somewhere? Just come on. Why? Give me bigger Zeds. Nope. They're going door to door. I don't know what uh, what they were doing, though. They might have just been friends with, uh, with their neighbors or something. Who knows? Anyway, it was, uh... It was kind of funny to me at the time, anyway, because... I'm going to go with the carbine. Because uh, right around the time that I saw them, there was like a whole bunch of uh, sirens going on around the uh, around around here, and then they started like kind of walking around looking all skittish. And uh, it's like the police looking for them? Probably not, right? The police probably do not care about these two girls walking around the uh, walking around the cul-de-sac. But are they robbing people? Are they rob? Are they robbing us? Should I be concerned? And the siren stopped, and they still looked skittish. And I'm like, you know what? It's probably just a couple of girls that just are skittish for cars or something. I don't know. Or maybe I'm just imagining things. Again, I don't really pay attention. I see somebody in my cul-de-sac. I really don't care. There's like six other houses in the cul-de-sac. You know? It's not like every time somebody's in uh, in this little cul-de-sac here that they're here for me. In fact, it's it's quite likely that they aren't, because I'm only one-sixth of the uh, the houses. Look at this infinite reload. Look at this infinite reload. Look at this infinite reload. I'm just chucking clips. Oh, I missed it. I'm just throwing the clips everywhere. It was intentional. The first one wasn't, but I thought it was funny, so I, uh, I continued it. We had a lot of sirens here lately, actually. I'm not sure what's going on, but uh, it's had me mildly concerned, anyway. I haven't seen anything on the news, so I suppose there aren't any, you know, serial killers running around. I also don't pay attention to the news, so who knows? Maybe there are serial killers around. Maybe I should, maybe I should be careful with my many walks out in the middle of the night that I don't even do anymore. God, I just, you know what I gotta do? I've stopped, I've stopped taking care of my hair as well. Since, uh, since the point, I should have upgraded this. Why did, why didn't I upgrade this? Hello? Me? Are you okay? Did I upgrade it? I did not upgrade it. Why did I not upgrade it? Me? Are you okay? Anyway. Um, what was I talking about? I had a thing that I wanted to mention. I, I can't remember what it is now. You're going away? Okay, you're not going away. You took zero damage from that, apparently. That's cool. I don't know how to kill those guys with this. Because I know that there is a way to do it. If you if you hit it right, you can kill them. I, I don't know what it is. I think you have to, like, impact their leg, and then you'll blow them up or something. Let's test that here. Yeah, hit their leg. 
You gotta get the impact damage on their leg to kill them, I guess. Sure. It's weird, but okay. That is some very strong armor, then, if it can just survive a blast to the face. But, you know, hey, whatever. I don't, I don't judge. What was I talking about? What was I talking about? I don't remember. I don't remember what I had for breakfast. I do remember what I had for breakfast. I had, um, nothing. I did not eat breakfast. You know, I like cooking. I really like cooking. I don't get to do it all that often, because, um, like, my parents do the cooking, and then I order food because I don't like what they make, and there's no real food in the fridge to make anything. Like, right now, we have a bunch of chicken in the fridge. This doesn't feel right. That's right. Like, this music doesn't sound like windswept, but maybe it is. I'll trust them. I'll trust them. I think right now, we got a bunch of chicken in the fridge. There's, I think... Six chicken breasts and then like a whole chicken cut up that we had the other day that was Greek seasoning. I don't know. They got they got they, they got this whole like epicure package thing. I don't know what they're doing with their lives, but I should have bought the whatever. It's all good. It's all good, man. It's all good. They bought this whole epicure package. It's got like some cutting boards and they got a paring knife and they got like some weird silicone molds for things and I don't know. They're probably gonna be all picky about it and be like, you can't use this one because it's, this one's super special, this one's a really good thing. I'm like, I don't know, it's from Epicure, how good can it really be anyway? Uh, yeah, you got a whole package thing, and why? Anyway, um, oops, that was a no good. So we time this one right. Yeah, we can. Bit of a sketch moment here, but we'll survive. Maybe we'll survive. So they got they got this whole Epicure thing, right? They got the um, cutting boards, the paring knife, the silicone molds, the spices. They have this uh, this one Greek spice container thing, and I'm like, I don't know, man. Just grab the spices that are the normal spices and then put them on the chicken. Like when you when you when you. When you Pre-have them in a, a container for specifically Greek spices. Now all of a sudden, if you want not Greek spice, all you have is Greek spice. You can't separate them, you know. Um, but anyway, uh, that's what we had the other day. So that's that's one of the things that's in the fridge is uh, some chicken that was uh, made with those that Greek spice. They got like a whole bunch of other spices too, and it's it's all these like mixed spices. I'm like, I, I just. Just, just use them separately. Like, why do you have to have them together? Just see what's in it, and then just, just use those. <laughs> just, just do that. But I mean, they don't, they don't like cooking. So, if they don't like cooking, I don't know why they spend so much money on random stuff for cooking, like this epicure stuff. Anyway, the moral of the story is we got, uh, we got that in the, in the fridge. We got uh, some chicken breasts in the fridge. We have, I think, probably about 50 eggs in the fridge right now. Uh, we have two peppers in the fridge. We have half of a container of mushrooms, and then the rest of the fridge is pretty much just filled up with like cheese and like pepperonis and like deli ham and various types of sauces like honey garlic sauce and sweet and sour sauce and soy sauce and cheese sauce and this sauce and that sauce and whatever, right? And uh, it's just. You know, I'd like to have broccoli in there. Brussels sprouts, asparagus, spinach. You know? Something something like that. But Nope. So uh Yeah, I end up I end up eating food that I don't particularly like and it's it's uh, it's really making it hard to lose weight as well. Cuz I just I end up ordering out a lot more than I particularly would want to. Because I'm like, I just, I don't want to go grocery shopping is the thing. I wouldn't mind going grocery shopping if I had, 
like a fridge to use. Like that would be one thing, but I don't have a fridge to use because our fridge is full of garbage. Uh, and then I don't have my own fridge, and it's like, well, I can go buy my own fridge, but for like 200 bucks, and like honestly, I just I don't have the money to do that responsibly because I'm spending so much money torturing out. Um, but anyway, it's it's kind of right. You had to get a headshot on those guys. It's just uh, unfun. I don't really remember what my point was, but. Um, I just don't want to eat veggies. I want to be a vegetarian. I was a vegetarian for a while. Like a week and a half or two weeks or something like that. And then I just, I couldn't, couldn't maintain it because we've got uh, like nut allergies and stuff here and it was just kind of hard. And then before I was able to really make it happen and work well, um, like COVID hit and uh, can't avoid that one because he's like weirdly below us for some reason. Um, so yeah, COVID hit, and then I, I couldn't, like, go grocery shopping, and now I'm kind of like, well, I don't really want to go grocery shopping, because I don't really want to go out into the, the great outdoors with COVID and all that. Even though it's probably fine, I mean, it almost certainly is, it's just, I'd rather not do it. I am thinking about getting a fridge, though, and then, uh, the other thing is I don't have my own kitchen, either. So I'd have to be eating it like just way later then so that they can make their dinner, eat their dinner, clean up the mess that they make, and then I can get in there and make my own thing. And at that point, it's like nine o'clock when I'm eating. It's just not, uh, it's not doable. It's not doable. But I don't remember what the point was. Just, we, don't, we, don't really, we don't really have food in the fridge. Kind of, kind of stinks. Anyway, that's going to do it for today. Thank you for watching. Remember to like it if you like and subscribe to see more in the future. Comment if you have anything to say, and I will see you next time. Bye-bye.